Hello, my name is Steve Bowler, and in this video we're going to be taking a look at Juniper Logical Systems. Specifically within Juniper Logical Systems in this lab we're going to be taking a look at how to use the Logical Tunnel Interface option. And the Logical Tunnel Interface option is only on specific Juniper routers. So not every Juniper router is going to have this option. So you're going to have to do a show interfaces or show interface terse to see if you have the LT interface. So what we're going to do is we're going to take a look at the concept of the logical tunnel interface, why you would use them, and for what reason. So just to summarize why you would use a logical system in the first place, what a logical system is going to allow us to do is to take just having by just having one physical router we're able to break it up into multiple logical systems so in this case we have a lab we have router 1 router 2 and router 3 but they all exist within one router and so this gives us the power to create our own network topologies using multiple routers within one router and then we're able to tie them together using the logical tunnel interface option. So essentially we can create any type of topology we want to. And of course there's a limit to the number of logical systems you can have within the Juniper, the Junos, or the Juniper operating system. And I think the max is either 15 or 16. So again that might not be 100% accurate because there are always Juniper's always looking to upgrade their you know their their Junos to be able to support more logical systems. So again, it's all limited to the router that you're on. And it should be noted that logical systems on a M series Juniper router is not the same as on a J series switch. So on the J series, a logical system represents a class of service option so it's not at all the, in, used in the same manner and I know that some of the newer SRX the Juniper SRX firewalls they are including support for logical systems again I don't think they're like the SRX 100s you know the lower end ones I think they're more higher end SRX's so that support is coming out soon. So what I'm going to do in this lab is I'm going to lay a solid foundation of how to use the logical systems using the LT interface option. So there's other ways you can